They'll need some extra time to warm up that car and scrape that windshield. Yeah, a windshield scraping morning. Thankfully, though, we haven't seen that uh, potential fog develop, and we're running out of time for that fog to develop. Once that sun comes up, we uh, basically can eliminate that from the forecast. Still a concern, though, for about the next 60 minutes. Our big October, historic October winter storm, it's all done with us. Temperatures bouncing back up big time, and we do not have a chance for rain or snow for at least the next seven days. Maybe you have to wait until next weekend or so. 64 or average high, still well below that, but we were only in the 40s yesterday. So a lot of us are going to melt away what's left of any snow banks, except for northeast New Mexico, where that snow is quite fresh, but we're still 50 to 55. Clayton, Raton, Las Vegas, Santa Rosa, and so your snow is going to take a big dent, and uh, tonight we'll do a refreeze in some spots with a dip down into the 20s and 30s, but a quiet, clear sky night, and then tomorrow melting away any leftover snow, certainly as we hit 62 in Vegas and approach 60 in Raton. There's a high of 60 in Albuquerque, mild stuff out there with lots of sunshine Friday. A little bit of high cloud cover drift since Saturday. Not going to take any enjoyment out of our Halloween. This is going to be a dynamite fall day. Just shy of 70 in Albuquerque. Socorro points south into the 70s. Even an 80 degree high temperature for you there in Carlsbad. Now if you have a lot of Halloween decorations, you might want to think about taking those down late on Halloween night because it looks like it will turn quite windy Saturday night and stay windy into Sunday morning. Sunday afternoon probably quiet. Just a bit cooler and then bouncing right back up by Wednesday Thursday of next week. We can't rule out topping out in the 70s once again here in Albuquerque. So that winter storm, it's fully in the rear view at this point.